girl who like myself. I've helped a lot of my guy friends get girlfriends because I kind of have their mentality sometimes. Exactly. But I would expect my male friends to go to their male friends first. I ain't gonna lie to you. If you know somebody... what's funny? You call them friends. If you thought like a man, you know that they're not your friend. Well, some some of them. <laughs> what are you saying right some now? Some of them I have slept with. Some of them. <laughs> Just my longest friend I haven't slept with. Then they're not your friends. <laughs> I mean, they got like girls now and everything, and we're still friends. Mm, that's awkward. Okay. I anyway. mean, uh, they definitely I think, don't uh, like <laughs> I think in general, um, most women don't know what it takes to be attractive to other women. Um, a lot of times, a female can only speak for her, from her own limited perspective of what she finds attractive. But in general, I mean, and we've done. I mean, we could play a game if you guys really want to see how little women know about being attractive. But um. But yeah, in general, I've realized that women don't give good dating advice at all. I think the only reason I said that was because I do go after men and women. So like, I know what I'm looking for in a woman. That's yeah, but that's irrelevant because do you think a woman that's bisexual has the same demands of a woman that she also has of a man? No, absolutely not. So null and void your experience. Yeah. Because when you're looking at a girl, you're not going to hold her to the same standards that you hold them to a man. As a matter of fact, the whole reason I even asked that question is for me to come to this conclusion. I'm going to be very honest about this. You guys might not like it, but I'll turn it to you guys. I think women are fairly useless outside of sex. If I'm going to be all the way 1,000. Um, women don't offer much value to you unless they either A, are fucking you and they respect you so that you can put them to work to do something for you and actually add value outside of sex. Or B, they work for you directly and you're paying them. Mm. But other than that, women really don't offer men much value. That's why I tell guys, don't have female friends because they're not going to give you that much value in return. You're better off hanging Masagini. out with uh, guys, having male friends, because you guys experience the same bullshit. You guys experience the same adversity. You're able to identify on that and work together to overcome it versus a female doesn't understand your experience. Most women don't understand the male experience at all, which I'm not knocking you guys for it. But the reality is, is that men live life on hard mode. Women live life on easy mode. I can't go ahead and make an OnlyFans and make 10K selling fee pictures. I don't have that available to me. I can't just be very pretty and get a man to rescue me. It's not happening. It's on my own. And I think as someone who um, needs to be able to grab themselves from the bootstraps, you're better off being around men that are going to tell you how the world really works versus women who are going to say some, some bullshit, like go see a therapist or whatever. Depression isn't real. You're just a loser. I disagree with that. My ex-husband was bipolar and he was crazy, crazy. Like there was n even, I didn't talk about bipolar, but that's, that's mental depression. illness. That's, that is depression. De bipolar. It has, to it has there's, depression. There's depression is a stage of life. There is. That was the there biggest is. reach I've seen in a long time. <laughs> bipolar depression. Two he had, things. he had depression. Two completely different things. Uh, bipolar is a disorder. So, it's not depression. So, so anyway, do you guys have any takes on that about what I said? I don't know if you agree, disagree, whatever. I know it doesn't sound the best, but. I genuinely don't think women offer that much value. And I've noticed this with bisexual women. If they're bisexual, they almost always will maybe have a phase with women, but they'll go back to men for long term. That's and then even women that are lesbian, they typically regress back to men after a period of time being lesbian. And I genuinely think the reason for that, right? This is speculation, open to you guys debate if you want. I think the reason for that is because men offer way more value. So if you're going to be in a relationship with someone at least be with someone that's stronger than you, could protect you, could provide for you, provision for you, be more logically sound. You don't have to deal with their bullshit hormones and emotions. They're going to be a lot more rational and stable than another female. That's what I've come to realize. And I genuinely think women don't offer much value unless you're fucking them. Let me ask you a question. Yeah. So, so 